I was just driving in the car and I started to have these kind of weird feelings in my chest that was kind of like a sinking type feeling. I started swimming and my heart rate was just like kind of a 30, 40% way higher than it usually is. You know, I thought like geez, something doesn't feel right. Uh, and then I kind of got out the pool and I was like completely out of breath. Went to an ECG test and they said, yeah, I've got like ab abnormal heart rhythm and that can cause stroke, heart attack, uh, you know, you name it. Doctor told me that, you know, your sports career is finished. You know, you can pack it in, get a, go get a normal job. I mean, to hear that when I've been like, it's what I do and it's the Olympic year and I'm just like, I, I couldn't even like, I couldn't actually come to like terms with what it actually said. I was just like, how is this even possible? People kind of think like, oh, it's just a sport, you know, it's just part of your thing, it's what you do. But it's like, if you think of like, okay, I'm doing this as a job and I've been doing it for 10, 15 years, and all of a sudden you lose your mind and you can't focus anymore. You can't do what you actually do at all. You're kind of lost. Uh, and I was like wrecked for weeks after that. Three months under the belt after the operation and uh, they sometimes say it takes up to a year to kind of stop feeling better and that type of thing. I'm not pretty much 100% sure where I stand yet, which is the kind of the thing, like if I did exercise and afterwards I'd have actually no issues, it would be great, you know, but that's not really the case. Like when I'm exercising, I feel it and afterwards I feel it and it's kind of just like this niggling thing that's there all the time a little bit. I don't feel like I'm, I'm stuck in the part where I'm still evolving and seeing how things work uh, and I'm seeing how I recover and I'm almost like giving myself that time to allow myself to think and not to make like brash decisions because I think the thing is is that when things are going bad you'll make one decision when things are going well you'll make a decision. I more or less knew that I just needed to keep enduring and, and, and my performance and enduring performance in that regard was one of the biggest things to be able to uh, keep going and to be able to you know get the operation done and try and push myself as much as I could within safety to compete for, for my country and uh, you know, one of the biggest things as a kid is to go to the Olympic Games. So, you know, for me, that was, was, was the big goal. And, you know, I went there and I was at the Olympics. Maybe I didn't compete, but I managed to see everything and be part of it. So, you know, I can, I can go away with that with a smile.